Alright, internet, hello and welcome. Mauki360 here, back for part, should be five, of our Pokemon Sword Let's Play. In the last part, we made our way to the first wild area, and we got our certification, and yeah. Also, I missed something back at the other station. I don't know if I can go back, but we're going to look and see if I can. Who knows? It might be these two. A. So, if you have Let's Go, if you have Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu or Let's Go Eevee or both, these people give you an Eevee or Pikachu. So yeah, we're not gonna be using this Eevee, but now we have it. Oh yeah, this one's a Gigantamax. Sorry, this one's the uh, Gigantamax that you can use. And, uh, something up. How do I have box links then? Maybe I just. Oh. There we go. Let's uh, get you in here. Anywho. So, if my sources are correct, which they should be, my sources being, uh, Cerebi slash Bulbapedia, then we should be getting a new Pokemon in the next episode or two. Depending on... actually, I can just do this. One thing I have to worry about, though, is the wild area. <laughs> I've been told these Pokemon are super high level. Wild Tyrogue. Oh. Huh. What area is this? What is that? Oh, that's a Vulpix. Looks like just like Vulpix and Bumblebees. Oh, that's an Onyx. That's probably going to be really big. Oh, a berry tree. You found a note. Cooking out of your camp can restore HP to your Pokemon and even the PP they need to use their moves over and over. And blah, blah, blah. Okay, so it's like a walking. Uh, yeah, I do want to shake it. I'm going to find a Crab Brawler, aren't I? Two orange berries. Shake more! Three orange, a petra, and a cherry. But yeah, from what I've been told, the wild area can be pretty nutty. Oh, I thought that was a star, Starly. Press the right stick, you finally can see why. Press the L button, look straight ahead again. More Vulpix. What is this wild area called? That's gonna be high level, I can tell you that right now. Rolling fields. Uh, that's a raid. Won't be doing those yet. Avoiding that. Oh god! Oh, pan gems. Okay, we want to find that bridge that's around here. Dappled Grove. Ow. I don't know if I'm allowed to show this, but my thumb's kind of hurting right now work stuff. Hey there, I found a bit of a rare item. Only 100. I don't have the money. Or whatever it is. I don't have enough W's. 
Yeah, I should probably not be picky with these wild encounters. I still do need experience. These things are way higher level than I am, so... Why am I faster than the Yadish? Click payback, hoping... Oh, that does a lot of damage. I don't have any flying type moves yet, do I? I actually don't remember if I have flying type moves. Hmm. I could be in a pickle here. Oh, I do have. I got Peck. And I'm faster. Although I probably won't kill this thing. Okay. <laughs> That's what I get for avoiding the. Higher level stuff. Let's uh So let's find out how camping works then, I guess, since we just got our shit pushed in. Okay. Oh. Oh I'm gonna gonna let you be. Ooh, Orenberry. Hey, don't I have a revive, actually? Pretty sure I got a revive from, uh... What's his dick? I do have a revive. Shake this berry tree again. Chesto, shake more. Chesto, try one more time. Oh! Oh, a Cherubi. What level is it? It's gonna be a high level angel. It's a Cherubi, so it has to be a high level. Right? Oh, it's only level 14. Oh, let's peck this thing. Hmm. My thought process is it's not stab, so it shouldn't do too much damage. And it's a Cherubi. A well, Cherubi evolves into Cherim, doesn't it? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. So Cherubi's the first one. It's a crit! So I'm just dumb. Don't worry about me. Nevermore grew to level 11. Do I still get to keep the berries or does it... Oh! Lame. Well, luckily I have a lot... Oh, Joy-Con Drift. Isn't that a great feature? Fortunately, my... My Pro Controller is not uh, accessible right now. So I gotta use Joy-Cons. White Herb. Get a rematch with this Oddish. Not the Oddish that I fought, but it's an Oddish. Sweet scent. <laughs> Alright. Shouldn't kill, but should do damage. Alright, this. Why is this artist so unaggressive? Last one just wanted to murder me. This one just wants to make it so I can't run. And it wants to get stronger. Oh, con. Sure. Be better than Lear. Wait, is Fury Attack flying type now? Or was that just something else I saw? 
Oh, I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a Badoo. I like Badoo. Well, mostly like Rosalie and Rose Raid, but whatever. Yeah, it's best for us to keep Nevermore up front in this. Seems like a lot of the... Uh, a lot of grass types. A lot of stuff that Nevermore will like to fight. Plus, be a good chance to get some grinding done. Because, uh, okay, Fear Attack is not flying type. That was probably... What a bastard. Luckily, I have Cherry Berries. What's he gonna do now? Bro. Not much he can do. I think he's only got Absorb at this level. Or it's only got Absorb. Ah, it's a she. It's only got Absorb at this level, so... And of course we get a crit there. Crit didn't matter. Hey! Isn't it Razor Leaf physical too? Uh, it is. It's stronger, that or Branch Poke. Okay, well goodbye Branch Poke. <laughs> Oh, hey, there's something here. Teeny Mushroom. Swoobat, Duskull, Ghastly, a lot of ghost types. <laughs> oh boy, uh, you can do your thing. All right. Oh, there's the bridge I was looking for. I guess I just ran her all the way around that lake for no reason. West Lake Axwell. I see a purloin. Oh. Temple. That's a C dot. Nothing I care about. That's a Quagsire. That means there's whoopers around here. Oh. Uh, oh. It seems like Pan Jam Snovers. That's a uh, snuffle. Stuffle? I think it's called Stuffle. Hmm. Oh. A lot of errors. Search certain energy measures from Watts. You can gather Watts yourself from glowing Pokemon dens and glowing Pokemon in the wild. You also find trainers in the wild there who are willing to give you all sorts of items if you'll just give them some of your Watts. Okay, so it's Watts is the thing. Hey. Snowverse. What do you want? I don't need anything. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Alright. No thanks. Well, looks like we're in Moto Stoke now, so. If we can go to. I think it's Route 3. I can't remember what route. It's one of these routes up here. I think I can catch it in Moto Stoke as well. Hmm. <clears throat> Oh, I hit my mic. My bad. There we go. Alright. Oh, hey, this is the first, uh, this is where the first trailer was. See, oh, hey, over here. Real ace of you to make it through the wild area. Seems like your trek ran your Pokemon right, though. You should pop into the Pokemon Center. Besides, there's something in there I bet you'll get a kick out of if you're a real trainer and all. What's in here? What's in here? 
Oh, looks like the Rotom's free. Ro Rotomi are a kind of Rotom in form of information service. It's a handy machine for trainers. You can even use one to customize your lead card. Why don't you try playing around with your lead card a bit, Yuri? Here's a sample for you. Leon's lead card. Show off your achievements by making a lead card. You can customize your card using the card maker, blah, blah, blah. Trainers all have their own lead cards, and you can swap cards with other trainers that you connect with you. Okay. Neat. But Motostoke sure is big, right? Not to weigh. Sonya here is to show what? Is here to show you around a bit. Come find me after you heal up your Pokemon. Opening ceremony, eh? I get a bit worked up when I think how exciting and moving it was to actually stand on a stadium's pitch for the first time. <laughs> Use card maker. Make a new league card. Background. These all look awful. I'll take the Eevee one. Effect. Oh god, that's blind. What was the effect there? I don't see it. What's this? These all look awful. No effect. I like how nothing is new. To next step. Uh... Oh. Surprised face. Sad face. Kinda happy face. Angry. <laughs> uh, this is funny. I like that one. Change pose. Cross armed, yes. Cross armed is my sh my jam. How do I pan the camera up? Oh, oh. There we go. Oh. That looks much better. Print it. Yeah, that's my card. Alright. Oh, heal. I have to actually use potions and shit. Alright. I'm here to buy. How many Pokemon? I got 22. I'm good. Alright, what do you got? You have po special Pokeballs. Nothing I can really use. No. That sounds like a terrible trade. It's always better we can Pokemon. Yeah. Doesn't the game not teach you that? I've, I've heard that it doesn't, and I don't remember. Ooh, an item. Oh, I found a nugget. Alright, we need to find grass. What else the city has left to take you between the three lower districts? Well, shit. Can't go that way. Oh. So, brilliant young trainer who's braved the wild area. Do you remember what your goal in Motostoke is? Uh, I'm here for the gym challenge. Yep, the gym challenge opening ceremony. Look, a Steenie. By the way, the ceremony tomorrow is being held at the Motostoke Stadium, okay? Oh, I see a close-up. Use that lift over there to get to the stadium, okay? 
Well, ladies, I'm going to swing by the shops while I'm here, but don't forget to register at the stadium, okay? Stadium, okay? That's how she would probably say it. We need to find grass. Alright. Oh god, I'm gonna sneeze. I feel a sneeze coming on. Let's talk to people. Nothing. Alright. Shopping with them. See if there's anything interesting in here. Oh, hey, look. I didn't even notice the door opening. Oh, God. Oh, this is our better hoodies. Oh, never mind. Hmm. Oh, they got it. Okay, well, I want to buy this now. Ah, Because I like the original outfit, I just didn't like the color. Oh hey, new hat. It looks awful. Yes. Oh god, those look horrible. Alright, well, I gotta go fix my outfit. There we go. Yes. Oh, hey, look, it's Sonya. My grand told me I needed to go on a journey, but a girl needs a bit of joy in her life, too. Are you here to do some shopping as well? Don't forget to register at the stadium. Ah, oh, ah. Oh. <laughs> yes. Oh, I walked into that person. What's we'll all this then? <laughs> Whoa, Garar. Oh, is it? Oh no, it's Leon. I'd surely never make it to the stadium without you. Show me the way, partner. Even with a huge old thing like this bang in the middle of the city, I still get lost. Yuri, all right. One look tells me that you become a trainer worthy of that endorsement I gave you. And yes, I reckon you might even be ready to use this. Here, try giving this to your partner to hold. Miracle seed. Nice. What is this fucking sponsor he's got here? This green squabbit looking thing. It's like right above the text box. You can take that lift up to the city's upper level. If you're headed for the stadium next. Well, kinda. I more or less want to find grass. Whoa! That was weird. I didn't like it. I'm leaving. Ah! Okay, well I might as well go do the gym thing. Probably gonna just keep... Oh, it's the Pokeball guy. Oh, the... Tilted. You made it too. Motor Stoke Stadium. This is where the opening ceremony will be held. Everyone will be watching the opening ceremony for the gym challenge. My mum, your mum, the whole world. Everyone's mums. It's getting me a bit nervous, really. Nah, this isn't nervous. I'm only trembling because I'm excited. Come on, Yuri. It's time the world learned our names. Who are you? We leaked staff here prior to support of the gym challenge. Everyone participating in the gym challenge is welcome to stay at the Badoo drop in. Damn. Would you take a look at this place? What? The place is packed. The gaff is packed with gym challenges. Every one of these folks is another rival. Oh, <gasps> I see best girl. Oh, let's get signed up. Look, it's our new douchebag of the game. He just radiates douchebaggery. 
Seriously, what a dickhead. If you're here to register for the gym challenge, I'll need to see your endorsement, please. Here you go. Fancy that. This is the first time we had a challenger endorsed by the champion. Well, now you've had two, because I am as well. What? Two of you at once? I wonder what's come over Leon this year. Two of you must be something special. <laughs> I'm Hop. I'm Leon's little brother, in fact. And the next champion. Get me all signed up, would ya? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm trying to... If you'll just give me a moment. There, your two have been successfully registered as gym challengers. You can now choose your preferred number to your uniform, if you be so kind. It will be displayed on the back of the uniform you must wear for any official match. Can I, oh, 059, there we go. 059, is it? Very well. And please, yeah, please wear this gym badge. What? So, basically the whole the lore behind this is, uh... There's a Spartan, Spartan in, uh in the Halo Halo lore named Malcolm my name uh, and that's his service tag is O the letter O and 59 so yeah basically you know you uh, people should if you're a Halo fan you know this every Spartan has like a service tag it's like three three characters Spartan Malcolm's is O59 that's the league champion for you even booked us all hotel rooms I'm off to check out the fancy digs. <coughs> oh. You're looking a bit gobsmacked by all this. You must be from some small country town, is that it? I'm quite the same myself. <laughs> you can tell she's important because she has a unique design. And she has question marks her names. Ow. Fuck. Which way to the hotel? No. Ah. But I'm gonna take on the gym. I was endorsed by the chairman himself. In other words, I'm not all these elite enough to get endorsement. I'm the most elite of all. So why don't you clear off and not try talking to me again, would you? It's positively criminal of you, wasting the time of someone as important as me. As I am. Fuck. Now what? I still don't know where I'm supposed to go. Eh. Oh. <laughs> it's not in here. Good to know. Oh. You must be Challenger Yuri. The voodoo drop in is down this way. If you be so as kind, do follow me. Looks like this is just a story episode. Well. We have arrived at the Badoo drop-in. Try to get some rest and build your strength for what's to come. I would get some rest, but I've got a Pokemon to catch. says on the way to Route 3, so assumingly, so I'm assuming Route 3 is this way. Oh, <gasps> you cut. No! Ah. Where's the grass I can access in this town? We will try to find this. I'm just going to cut to if we find grass or not. Oh, frick! You get a Pokeball if you talk to this guy. But then, who am I, you ask? Well, the answer is simple. They call me the Ball Guy. That's his voice. I'm gonna have one of those soon. Not soon, but eventually. I'll get you eventually. Oh. Wow, some idiot just threw away a Pokeball. Well, if there is grass in the city, it's... I don't know where it is. Pretty sure this was the end I'm supposed to go to, so... This will just be story episode. Ah. 
Ah, yeah. Looks like you both got yourselves registered. Oh, hi, Sonya. What are you doing at our hotel? I'm researching the, mo the mysterious Pokemon that are said to be in the slumbering world. I reckon if I look into some Galar's legends, I might figure something out. Care to join me? You're here already anyway. What's this then? It's the statue of the hero who once saved the Galar region. I could run through the legend right quick if you fancy. Short version if you please. Long ago, a great black storm covered the Galar region. People called it the darkest day. The land was assaulted by gigantic Pokemon, but they were defeated by a single young hero bearing a sword and shield. This statue here is meant to depict the young hero of that legend. Huh. I suppose that hero must have been about as strong as Lee then. Looks like you're going to have your hands full with plenty of research though, Sonya. Black storms and swords and shields and all. You'll be alright, Sonya. Heh, <laughs> thanks. I'll muddle through somehow, don't you worry. You two are staying here at the local, at the hotel, right? Tonight though, aren't you? Shouldn't you check in? Probably so. And we'll look out for you too, Sonya. If we hear anything about any hero or whatnot, we'll tell you.